Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. Salar Khan here. And today we see an, uh, another design of multiplexer and we see the 8 cross 1 max uh, using 4 cross 1. Alright, so this is our today's example an 8 cross 1 using a 4 cross 1 max. Now you know the basic method of it, but this would be a little different. Okay, how would it be? So we'll see now. Some people would call it a special case. I won't call it a special case because special is something special, right? And this is not something special because in the next few video we'll see another uh, example like this. So that would also be a special case. Then we would have a third like that. So that's not special then, okay? Special is a single one, okay? So I would call it a special case. All right, back to the top. So you know the basic method, the required divided by the available, okay? So let me write it down, required uh, divided by available, and you go on until you have a what? A one. So in this case, the required are eight, and the, 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 the available are four, so you have a two. Now be careful, you have a 2, you take this 2 and you divide it again by the 4 to get a 0.5. Now this is the tricky part of it. You get a 0.5, alright? In the previous video, in the two videos, we saw some simple examples, but this time it's a little tricky. You have a 0.5. Now, what to do with this 0.5? So, in this case, we mean to say that if you have three multiplexers in place, so the out, the, the third, the inputs of the third multiplexers are all not used. Okay, 0.5 means half of them are used and half of them are not used. Or we can have this by another method as well, and the other method is what that we use the enable using enable now you know what the enable is from the previous basics of the multiplexers that when the enable is one the multiplexer is on if it's not one so the multiplexer circuitry is not working so previously it was considered previously uh, when we were not uh, using it in the in the tree or in the examples so it was considered as one all right it was considered as high that it was that the multiplexer circuitry was working in this case where we have this fraction sort of a problem so we vary we vary the enable we vary the enable to turn on and on the on and off the multiplexer now how is that so we see this over here so which means we have uh, two uh, <coughs> sorry we have two uh, four cross one multiplexers all right in the whole number so we take the whole number so this is now let's say the first okay uh, and this is the second so this is a four cross one and this is a 4 cross 1. Now you know we have 4 inputs to this. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4. And 4 to this. 1, 2, 3, 4. And 2 select lines to each. Alright. Now uh, the inputs are let's say what? They are I0, I1, I2, I3. And then we have I4, I5, I6, and I7. And we have the enable signal. This is the enable signal. All right. Now we make one of the enable signal at a high and one as an active low. All right. Which means like this, okay? So let's say I've given this directly the enable signal. And I give the enable signal to this uh, particular multiplexer through the NOT gate. And this is, let's say, the signal. From here I'm giving it, okay? So let's say I, I play, I name it uh, E, okay? 
and 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 you know from from the basics that this would be the s1 and this is s0 this is s1 and this is s0 now what did i mean by this not gate so from by this i meant that if i need to give a, a one over here so over here i will have a zero and this multiplexer will not be working and similarly if i give a zero i did so this multiplexer will not work and this not gate will complement it to one and this multiplexer will work now uh, for to give in to get an output out of this two we need uh, we need to place an or gate so we place an or gate over here and we we give the final outputs of this multiplexer and this multiplexer to it to get the final output y okay so now you know uh, from the truth table right uh, if let's say for example I need to place uh, this I not at the final output all right so if I need I not so I need this multiplexer this particular multiplexer in the working state so which means I have to give the enable signal zero from here so if I give it a zero we'll have a zero over here and we'll uh, and this multiplexer then will not be working and we will have a zero at this point now, if you have a zero at this point now this NOT gate will complement it and we'll have a one at this point which means this particular uh, multiplexer is now on and now you know for for I not to be transmitted you need to place uh, the switches as one and as not as zero zero so you have an I not over here and you're oring them so you have an I not over here now that's simple all right now let's say let's say you need to have I four over here okay so for i4 you need to do what uh you need to place uh, now you need to turn on this multiplexer so the enable signal given is a one from here which means this would now be a one so this multiplexer would be on and now this will complement it to give it a zero so this multiplexer will be off we'll have a zero over here now for this you need to have i4 so i4 is its first entry which means you need to give them a zero zero so you have a zero zero you have an i4 over here now the or operation will give you an i4 over here is that fine all right this is simple okay just this point this enable point was a little confusing whenever you have a fraction like this so we will be using what we will be using this enable signal in the next video we see a little more tough example uh, and that would probably be the last as well. So that's enough for today. That's enough for this lecture. See you in the next lecture very soon, inshallah. Till then, take care. Goodbye.